love okra but hate the slime that will be me so today i'm going to show you how i made this quick and easy slime free okra i hope you're inspired to try this so let's cook the ingredients are here but they are listed in the description below okay all you need is a good non-stick pan and a little bit of oil for about seven gram 700 gram of frozen okra i use about two tablespoons of oil just that little we are not deep frying this guys just pan frying okay and straight from frozen you don't need to defrost this so we are going to fry this for about five to eight minutes i will say on a medium to high more on the high okay we are going to fry this if you can get yourself a flat silicone spatula like this this makes my job easy you see what you're doing and just slide in there it doesn't mash up the 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 okra not rough on your pan okay you get what i mean okay get yourself a silicone pan spatula guys okay so you have to be present because you are pan frying this and you have to keep on turning so that you bring the ones that are down up and everything so everything can kind of get out the heat to remove that slime okay it's already going at this stage but i continue because i cannot stand even a little bit of slime so i had to keep on frying and as i mentioned it took me about seven minutes okay look at that no slime this is what i like to see no slime okay <laughs> oh goodness okay come closer guys let's have another quick look see no slime okay set this aside put it on a paper towel to absorb that excess oil and let make the sauce for the sauce is easy some oil onion garlic and tomato at first we fry the onion for about two minutes until it's nice and soft after two minutes we go ahead and add in minced garlic and we fry this again for 30 seconds just the garlic to release its natural flavor and goodness and we follow that with some canned tomato i'm using just about half a cup of canned tomato i don't like it too much tomato in it but you can put more or less it's your sauce i just put you know this is the amount anyway fry the tomato for five minutes until all the liquid absorbed okay and then i went ahead and add in the vegetable stock as you can see there yeah that jelly liquidy one okay this one yes the no vegetable stock guys i just add that in add a little bit of water to help the the stock to melt quickly the this no vegetable stock guys is like my all-purpose seasoning when i use this no salt or nothing that else is added okay anyway once it's melted we're going ahead and add in the shrimp these were frozen i just defrosted them about two hours before cooking add them in then mix them in let them kind of marry well with the tomato just say for 30 seconds really follow that with the fried pre-fried okra and again give this a good mix let everything meet each other and give each other hug okay <laughs> anyway after this then you can season this to your choice me i don't the stock is enough however i like my food hot so i just added a little scotch bonnet in there and then i add in hot water always add in hot water when you are already cooking you don't want to stop the cooking process so hot water add in to your liking start small so that you can add don't just pour it then you regret okay add in until you are happy with the liquid mine i just added a little bit more and i was happy with that cover this and then let it simmer for about five to eight minutes after eight minutes reduce the heat let this simmer for about you know eight minutes later here we go this was so good guys oh my goodness i wish i could send you this but let me know in the comment what you will serve this with the main thing is where is the slime nowhere no slime and this was so good i hope you're inspired guys thank you so much for watching until next time bye